Said I was gonna make a video about it. Decided to do it. The Lucky Duck Flocker forearm rotating machine. Boom! There it is. Forearms on top of it. Right like that. I got it equipped with the XX flying decoys. I want to say one of the best decoys I've ever used. Go check them out, sxdecoys.com. Message them, they'll help you out. Got a bunch of things in stock, big moves coming. But, like I said, they fit right on the arm real easily. Kind of hard to do. Boom, put them on there. A little tighten up, tighten it up. Works great. Like I said, I can, right now I got, for just demonstration, I got two of the straight heads, two of the cock heads. Uh, this is not how it all goes. There's two extra arms. I'll show you those right now. I get them out of the way. Comes in this sweet bag. Still all of it. But you get 10 of these. Put them right there so you can see. You get 10 of those. So theoretically, you're supposed to use, there's supposed to be two extra ones. So the two extra ones are supposed to be a forearm rotator, anything like that. So you have two extra extension poles and an extra arm at the end. <clears throat> so, but I like to go a little bit further. So as you can see, there's a spot for a fifth one right in the middle. So on the fifth one in the middle, I'm going to put a real wing 360 air flyer on it. Get that movement. I mean... The way the decoys look now, they're not going to be that close. They're going to be six foot approximately out each way. So it's going to be from here, it's going to go six foot that way, six foot that way, all the way around, six foot. So I'll have plenty of room right in the middle for the 360 fire to go around. I think it'll just give a little bit more extra, you know, detail or anything like that. Um, things I really like about it, I'm a big Lucky Duck fan. I'm not sponsored by them. I don't get no discounts. I had to pay the same price here, which you can get at Presley's for $239. Tax and shipping, everything like that. For me, I got it in two days from Speedy. It cost me $148 in some sense, so $149 basically, round up to you know $250. But I love all their products. I mean, I got their 2x4 blind, their uh, pulsator quiver butts, their spinning decoys, and this is just another thing. And it's great quality and everything like that. I mean, it literally it comes out of the box with this all piece in, the, in together. I mean, it has a timer, or not a timer, a speed on it. So you can go from slow to fast or off. And I think the other nice thing about that, you have a remote. So it already comes pre-programmed for the remote. But it's all steel construction. It has a big old bearing on it and everything like that. Heavy duty motor. <clears throat> the plugs are quick connect so you can easy storage. You can unplug it. Keep that with the battery wrapped up and everything. It has a four leg brace system on the main stake. So you just push this in the ground as far as you can. You tighten up to the four legs. You got the two handles to be able to push down. The motor and everything's held on with a set screw. So, like, this whole piece will come right off the center stake. So, you set the stake first. I mean, for what I can see, it's, it's a great setup. Really well built, all metal. Nothing's chinksy on it. I mean, when I hunt, I hunt pretty hard on everything like that. So, I can't have nothing cheap. When I saw this, anyway, instantly was drawn to it. And I'm like, dude, this is going to be, has to be a great product. Everything else I got from Lucky Duck's been great. So <clears throat> I figure match with those, with the SX Flyers. When I go down to Missouri at the end of the month, if we still got geese down there, I'm hoping to bust this thing out and my little spread and everything like that and see if we can get into them. If not, we'll just wait and see if they come up up here by home. But that's my quick review on the Lucky Duck Flyer. Like you said, it's supposed to be a forearm. I'm just using the fifth arm for it. Like I said, deep cycle battery. You get 10 of those, so you can actually run the center one six foot high and do a spin, which I'd probably end up doing that just to making sure it's going to stay balanced and everything. But you can, uh, oh, it also comes, make sure, with the real wings, you have this, it comes with this bag. It comes with the snap caps on the end and the washer. So you can go ahead and run the real wing spinners and 360 feathers on all this. If you don't want to run the flyers, you can go with the real wing. Check them out. They got 360 spinners and flyers. You can go ahead and hook them on here to have that as moving. I know a lot of people use that. But that's just another thing. Like it, This thing will literally fit any spinner flyer you have. Um, so you can't really go wrong. If you're a snow goose hunter or anything like that, I plan on maybe even using this for duck season. I mean, if I can go ahead and get four Lucky Duck air spinners on that, put that out in the field and act like a, you know, like a Vortex machine that they used to have or do the same way, Take the arms, flip them around, and just tie a string to it, and have the air flinger sit on there, and we use it. I mean, that could be the thing. I mean, it, it, the options are endless. It's 
you know, a lot of people use it for snow goose hunting. I think I can use it for duck hunting, kind of end the game in that one too, put a little extra motion to it. But like I said, it's a great, great product, made with great material, you know, everything like that. It's just, it's insane that, you know, the remote system, I mean, here, we'll just check it out. It's going to make some noise, going to hit the fan, but I hit the button. And that's nice. But you see how fast it's going? Let me slow it down. The nice thing to be able to control the speed. So you can see, of course, it's going to look faster when they're further out, but, you know, put them like that. I mean, I've always been intrigued by these things, so it's kind of hard to beat it. It's kind of a, kind of a beautiful thing. Now you just go ahead and hit off, shuts her off. So versatility, compactness that it has for it, and be able to use a remote where you don't have to leave it on the whole time spinning while you're waiting and worry about killing the battery. You get you know a longer battery life out of it because you're using a remote and everything like that. And the nice thing is you can probably program this remote if you're looking at if you have other lucky ducks that don't have remotes on. Well, you buy this, you already come with the remote. You just gotta go buy a receiver. So then literally all your whole spread. The lucky duck fires, the lucky duck flying, you know, snow goose flapper, Canadian goose flapper, the ducks, everything will all run off of this remote. So you can literally have one remote to run everything you have. You want to go snow goose hunting? Grab your snow goose thing, your uh, flocker out, grab your snow goose big flappers, put them out there, boom, on a remote. Everything like that. <clears throat> that thing, it's also nice to set on a timer. So you can go ahead and take that bad boy, put it on timer mode, on or off, and it'll just turn on every once in a while. Probably won't use it for the vortex or the rotator. But the Flocker, I mean, it's pretty solid. So if we're going to get in a Flocker this year, I suggest looking at Lucky Duck. Uh, if you have any questions, leave comments. I'll help you the best I can. Like I said, I'm not sponsored by them. I don't get nothing from them. So I'm not really sure all the details, just what I told you right now. Uh, message them. See what they say. Like I said, if you're looking for some flyers and snow goose season, I know snow goose season's already almost, you know, we're halfway into February already. Uh, go check out SS Decoys, see what they can do to help you with that. I mean, they're a great company. Customer service is great. Just, just great all-around people with a great product. They literally care about what their product does, and they care about what the consumer thinks. So go ahead and give this uh, video a like and everything like that. I hope this helps you out. If you have any questions, let me know, and I will leave you off a little bit of spin action. Have a good night.